How is everybody doing? So me and my man is hacking in today's video. I'm going to be taking a quiz about Cobra Kai. Let's hop into it. All right, so this is the ultimate Cobra Kai quiz on this website called Beano. So I'm going to leave a link to it in the description if you want to have a go at it yourself. But I'm about to take it right now. So question one, what is the motto written on the walls of Cobra Kai in the dojo? So this is quite an easy one. And obviously, it's please wash your hands. Everybody knows that. No, it isn't. I'm, I'm joking. It's time for Sweep the Leg Saturdays. What was the name of the competition where Daniel LaRusso defeated Johnny Lawrence? I think it was, you know, it's the All Valley Tournament, Karate Tournament, obviously. Uh, the first season of Cobra Kai, what does Daniel LaRusso do for a job? He sells cars. Uh, question four, why does Daniel want Cobra Kai to be closed down? He prefer a cool coffee shop instead, he's worried his students will become bullies. He doesn't think people should learn karate because he's the best and always will be. Trick question, he loves the place. Uh, I'm fairly confident that it's, that it's that one. Who is the older martial art artist by eight months? Oh. Eight months? I'm going to say it's Daniel. I think it's Daniel purely because he has his birthday before the tournament. And I'm guessing like based on the school year and everything it's going to be in. Which of these do you, do you like to watch at home the most in your spare time? And this doesn't affect your school, so I'm just going to put on like YouTube video clips. Alright. Number six. Who said it? I wasn't taught the difference between mercy and honor, and I paid the price for it. Johnny. Uh, in which country was Miguel Diaz born? I'm pretty sure it's Ecuador because that's where his mother came from. He had to get, she had to get far away from her father, so it would probably be, be Ecuador. But Mexico's where the father lives in season five. Which TV show is Daniel Russo a fan of? Game of Thrones, because he says, oh, I'm so down with GOT. So I'm pretty sure it's Game of Thrones. But you don't really know because you don't know a lot about Daniel, aside from the Miyagi and stuff. Who said everyone's got a sub story that doesn't give you the right to be a bully? Sam. Because it's like Tori and Sam's rivalry. It's the whole point of season four, season three. What's the name of the dojo run by both Daniel and Johnny? And there it is, the score, 10 out of 10. But could you be surprised? It was a pretty easy one to get a perfect score on, so... I can't say I'm I'm surprised 100% by this score, 10 out of 10, because you saw the questions, they were fairly easy. But feel free to leave in the comments if you've ever tried this quiz before I've done it and what your score was. Guess I'm guessing it was 10 out of 10, because every single one, except for who was the older martial artist, was I, I knew the answer to, like 100% knew the answer to. But that's not to say that there weren't some that might trick you, especially if you didn't watch the original Karate Kid movies as well as Cobra Kai. But I remember the thing that was so crazy about Cobra Kai when it came out is literally just before that series got announced to be on YouTube Red was when I just watched the original Karate Kid movie because I, when I was about 11, I got into watching the Karate Kid 2010 film because we were watching it before Christmas in school. And then after that one, after watching that one, I heard that it wasn't the original one. But I thought, obviously, because it was an old movie and I was 11, I thought, oh, it's going to be worse than the new movie. New movies are superior. But I remember seeing loads of people commenting on clips from the film, saying, like, oh, I prefer the original movie with Daniel and Mr. Miyagi. So for that reason, I decided eventually to check it out about 14 or whatever in 2018. And then when that happened... Then just after I'd watched that, I was watching clips from the other films because I'd watched the original Karate Kid movie, but I couldn't really find anywhere except on like illegal websites to watch the other films, the second and third one. So because I wanted to watch the, the, those films, I just looked at clips from them as opposed to watching them. And then after that, a YouTube ad came on about YouTube Red announcing Cobra Kai and that it was coming out. And then obviously YouTube with YouTube Red eventually YouTube Premium took over and you could just get a free subscription for one month and watch the episodes. So I did that and watched all the episodes. But then that meant I couldn't watch season two for ages until in like summer 2019, I believe. 
they put all of the episodes onto YouTube that you could watch them for free. So I did that and then waited for season three to finally come out on Netflix. But yeah, that's just a bit of a backstory about how I got into Cobra Kai in the first place because it seems a bit random that I just decided to get into making videos about Cobra Kai. Really, I got into it because I just needed something else to do during the lockdown when I wasn't at school and I didn't have a lot of other things to do outside of that. I was just at home, it was kind of just something else to do. But yeah, let me, let me know you guys if you enjoyed this video and if you enjoy these sorts of videos where I'm sitting down and just talking about the series and the show and taking this quiz. I guess you might be a bit bored by now of me just talking about that quiz was very long so I just wanted to pad it out for a bit more. But yeah, let me know you guys if you thought this quiz was way too easy and if you want me to attempt a more difficult one in the future. And because it was so easy and because it didn't take very long, you might see another video this week. I don't know, I'm not going to make any promises but I might try and get another video out, video out for you guys. There will definitely be shorts, so stay tuned for that. But without, with all that being said, it's been your Meme Meme Zach. I hope you enjoyed the video. Feel free to leave a like if you did. And remember to stay amazing. Bye. She thinks I'm ugly. She thinks I look like Dudley. Never thought this could be funny. Drinking tea, but it's not sunny.